Hey guys, this is Dr. Carl Baird of Evolve Performance Healthcare. Today we're going to talk about the best exercises you can do if you are involved in a car accident and are experiencing some neck pain. One of the most common symptoms after a car accident is neck pain and headaches caused by again that whiplash motion, head coming back, head coming forward, damages discs, injures the muscles as well. And so what we want to do is give you three exercises that you can easily do at home if you're involved in a car accident. So the first one, the goal is of this exercise is one, to restore range of motion. So a lot of times after an accident, um, we lose range of motion just as the body's trying to protect itself. We wanna get that range of motion back. It also helps decrease pain and speed the healing process. So these exercises are just called pain-free range of motion of the neck. So all we're gonna do is take the neck through range of motion exercises in that pain-free range. So what we'll start with is about 30 seconds to a minute of just going right to left. 30 seconds to a minute of bending right, bending left, and then 30 seconds to a minute of flexion and extension. It's like this. So the key here is that we're keeping it in a pain-free range. So if it's a really acute accident, it was a bad accident, and all you have is this much range of motion, that's all you're gonna start with. And what you'll notice, as the pain dies down, your range of motion is gonna get bigger and bigger the more you do this exercise. So that's exercise number one. The second exercise, we wanna start building strength back in those neck muscles. So again, those neck muscles got really stretched with that whiplash motion. We wanna build that strength and also be sure that the muscles are healing in the right way and that the soft tissue that's being laid down is being laid down parallel with the muscle rather than creating scar tissue which hinders uh, range of motion in the future. So to do that, we have what are called isometric neck exercises so again same thing we're going to go through range of motion but this time we're going to stop it with the hand so we'll start with rotation and so all we're going to do is put our hand to the right i'm going to try to turn my head to the right and again just using my hand to block that motion but i'll feel just these muscles working on this side hold it for about five seconds and then we'll go back the other way so now we're going to turn to the left and again now we're feeling the left side and then bending to the right bending to the left is the next so hand on the side of the head Bend to the right, hand on the side of the head, bend to the left. So again, it's isometric, so there shouldn't be any actual motion of the head. It should just be pressing in. And then the last two are flexion. So hand on the front of the head, bend forward, hand on the back, press back. And there you go. So that's how we start to build strength back up in the neck. The next exercise is gonna to be to build some stability back in that neck. So strengthening these deep cervical stabilizers with an exercise called chin tuck. So <clears throat> what that's gonna look like is all we're gonna do is we're gonna bring this chin straight back. So it's not flexion. We're not flexing the neck down this way, but we're thinking of pulling the neck straight back. So it looks like that really attractive giving yourself a double chin but you're going to hold that for about three to five seconds and we should feel a little tension in the back of the neck there if we're doing it right and back tuck the chin and back and so what that's doing again is it's strengthening our deep neck stabilizers and that's it those are the three exercises to do if you're involved in a car accident if you were involved in a car accident and you're in the portland area the other thing that you should know is through your auto insurance, it's called personal injury protection, you do have $15,000 worth of care with no out-of-pocket costs. So follow the link below to learn more about personal injury protection. If you're in the Portland area, you can always give us a call. This is Dr. Carl Baird with Evolve Performance Healthcare. Thanks for watching.